What's up, vlog? I hope you're. I hope you're having a good Valentine's Day. I am. I am. Um. My children, and by my children, I mean my ex, got me a box of cupcakes from Crave, which is like one of the. It, it's so good. It's one of the best places in Houston for cupcakes. Um, one of the two <laughs> very good places. So that was really sweet and unexpected, um, but I had one that was very good. But then I'm also crying because, well, I'm crying because it happened again. And by it, I mean what happens with relationships, except I can't even call them relationships because it's like so short lived. I'll tell you what I'm talking about. So like last week, I met this guy, this gentleman, and we just started talking and we kept talking and then like I sort of liked him and when I like somebody then like things change and I a I get like terrified of talking to them and terrified of communicating with them so I just avoid them at all costs so if I if I like you I'm probably avoiding you um, yeah it's like a I'm like a 14 year old boy but if I can muster up the courage and, and I get over that then like inevitably, if I like you, when we're talking, if when I like somebody, I'm super, I feel super vulnerable and I get so sensitive, I'm very sensitive. So inevitably, you're gonna say something without meaning it or intending that's gonna upset me. So that's what happened. We were texting and he said something that was like totally just kind of normal. And, what, and like if two friends were joking, like, it would just be like, you know, you're giving somebody a little bit of shit. Like, and not even that. Like, not even that. Like, it's not even a criticism. It's just a comment that when I'm in such a sensitive m mood, I feel that it's like a uh, criticism or my feel. Okay, my feelings get hurt. They shouldn't, but they do. Like, a few weeks ago, it was um, this guy said something about the resolution of one of my videos and he was right it was awful um, it was it wasn't awful actually it was perfect for what it was so he was right in the sense of the resolution was bad he was very very wrong in the sense of that that, that that was irrelevant to the piece so and it hurt my feelings because that's what he noticed as opposed to like the work I put into it so I got upset and then of course he's like wow she gets upset so easily if she's gonna get upset over something so small like that's a red flag she's crazy which is accurate because that's what happens and that so that's what happened I got upset and I stopped talking to him and then we haven't spoken since and so that just happened again so there was this new guy who I liked and the same thing happened you know, it started off the same way, everything's fine and normal, except then he just said something that's completely normal, but it hurt my feelings. So now my feelings are hurt and I've stopped talking to him and that, so now that's the end of that. So it's just like, almost like, you just sort of feel like it's pointless. Like this is, and so what's gonna happen in a couple weeks? The same thing's gonna happen. I'm gonna meet somebody, I might sort of like him, we're gonna start, we're gonna, I'm gonna meet somebody, we're gonna start talking. I'll decide that I like them, so then I'll turn into a weirdo, and then they're going to hurt my feelings, and I'm going to stop talking to them. Oh. Pattern repeat, pattern repeat, pattern repeat. So that's basically what this vlog is about. Um, other than that, Valentine's Day was really good. I had a nice, well, I have little kids, right? I have a two-year-old and a three-year-old, so Valentine's Day is just hoopla for little, little, little tiny people who... Ah, they get their valentines and their cards and some candy and ah. So it's just, um, it's a lot of fun. So I, I had a good day. But I might cry a little bit more. I'm going to try not to, but uh, I don't know. Say the V. I I don't know why I'm leaning so close to the camera. I can sit back normally and talk. There's an idea. Good night.